לא הפרשה ויצא ליום שישי. דבר אחר, על מה זה אתה יקחה נועם? It is written for the world above, the world to come. It's, uh, it's, well, it's uh, written Noam. It's called Noam. What is Noam? Noam means uh, nice, uh, pleasant. יכול להתירה על מד עתה, כל חירו וכל תירו וכל נחורים וכל חירו זה על מד יתירה. And when the, uh, we call the Olam Abba, it's manifested. Okay, and then there's all the joy and all the goodness in the world. And the beginning of it, it's Noam, that's why it's called Noam. ועדיין תנין אנחנו חייבים דיירות בגינם בשרתה דעה על שבתה ונכין כולהו ויתריבו חירות ונחיה בשרתה דפיק שבתה יתלדה דעה חדור אלא הענת מנשתזי נהרו עונשה וחוויה ויתלדנו והיא שרתה עול הלאה. And we have learned that the רשרים that are in the גינם when שבת comes in Friday night they have rest And as soon as you start, they have this complete rest and there is uh, and also this uh, menucha. You know, this, uh, they, they are not being punished. But as soon as uh, Shabbat finishes, right, which is Saturday the night, okay, then they go back to, to being uh, in the Gainom and to get, to, to, uh, get the punishment that they're supposed to get there. And uh, that's why for us it is important to, to simulate the simcha elyona, this higher simcha. And uh, how do we do that? Because we, when we say this pasuk v'yei noam, Hashem Elokim, which we have to Shabbat, he said noam alenu, that we should bring this uh, noam, so that we, we try to keep this imprint of Shabbat, from Moshe Shabbat until Shabbat Abba, as a fact, every day. There's, a, there's one level of this simcha of Shabbat that we try to keep with us until we get to the next Shabbat. And we do that also to be saved from the, uh, the punishment uh, that all these Hesharim are, are being judged and are, are getting in the Geinam, standing Musa Shabbat. And uh, like we said, so we see this, uh, this uh, Pasuk, Vinoam. And uh, it is also written. He says, all the all its ways are ways of are pleasant ways, and all its shabbatim uh, is also its ways. Okay, are called shalom. Shuel, what do you mean by nitivotia, which is another way of saying uh, ways? He says it uh, represents. He said they are the ones that come out from from higher. Which is what, which is called the nav, lav netivot chokma, to lead to path of chokma. The good like it lone berit yichidai dehu itche shalom shalabad evite. And together, they go to what we call the 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 berit, which is the, the berit is uh, the mida yesod. And we know the yesod is also is also called shalom, shalom bait, vayilon leyamar abba, and. It comes out to what we call the Yama Rabba, the Yama Gadol. Which, what is the Yama Gadol? This is Malchut. You know, the word that the harmony is done between the masculine and the feminine. Gad Igu Betukfe. Yidiru Kedan Yahib Shilema. When he's strong, when the masculine is strong, so then that's what is strong. That means we know that the Shabbat is the highest Zivub. And in the morning, particularly, it's the, the Zivug and Musaf, which will be Israel and Rachel. So it's a higher harmony between the masculine and the feminine. And this is how there is the Shalom, as it is written, the Chod Nitivotea Shalom, and all these ways are Shalom.